In this video, we will see trigonometric ratios of complementary angles. What are complementary angles? When the sum of any two angles is 90 degrees, we will say that as complementary angle. When you take a right triangle, right angle triangle A, B, C, where it is right angled at B, the remaining two sides, the sum of the remaining two sides will be 90 degree. That is angle A plus angle C is equal to 90 degree. We will say that as angle A plus angle C. When you find the sum of these two angles, it will be 90 degree. Okay. You know trigonometric ratio. Sin, cos, tan, cosecant, secant, cot. Okay. So here, when you take sin A. What is sin A? Sin A is opposite by hypotenuse. For sin A, opposite side is BC. Okay. So for sin A, BC by hypotenuse. BC by AC, BC. BC by AC. Then, then for sin C. For sin C. So for sin C, it is AB by AC. For sin C, opposite side is AB by Hypotenuse is AC. AB by AC. Okay. Same way you take cos also. So cos A is equal to. What is cos? Cos A is adjacent by hypotenuse. Cos A is adjacent. Adjacent by hypotenuse. Then cos C. So cos C is cos also adjacent by hypotenuse only. So cos is cos C is adjacent. Adjacent is BC by AC. Okay. So when you see these four ratios. Sin A, Sin C, Cos A, Cos C. You see this. See the right hand side of these two ratios. Here also it is BC by AC. Here also it is BC by AC. So what is the meaning? The left hand side for Sin A for these two ratios are equal. If the right hand side is equal, left hand side will also be equal. That is sin A is equal to cos C. These two are equal. See this? Sin A is equal to cos C. Now, cos C, the C, angle C, you can write it as 90 minus angle A. A plus C is 90 degrees, so you can write angle C as 90 minus A. So, here instead of C, I am writing it as 90 minus A. Okay. So, it is cos 90 minus A. So, sin A is equal to cos 90 minus A. Okay. Same way here also. See this. Cos A is equal to AB by AC. Here also you have AB by AC. So, these two values are equal. These two left hand sides are equal. That is cos A is equal to sin C. Same way you replace it. Sin 90 minus A cos A. So what will you say these two as? This one and this one are complementary angles. That is sin A is equal to cos 90 minus A. Cos A is equal to sin 90 minus A. So these two are complementary angles. The same way you can do for the other four ratios also and check like that. If you check like that, you will get cosecant, cosecant A is equal to secant 90 minus A and secant A is equal to cosecant 90 minus A. The same way if you do the same procedure, if you apply, you will get these two complementary angles are equal, you will get that is Cosecant A is secant C you will get. That secant C will be replaced by 90 minus A. Same way secant A is equal to cosecant C. Cosecant C is 90 minus A. Same way tan also. Tan A is equal to tan A is equal to cot 90 minus 90 minus A. And cot A is equal to and cot A is equal to tan 90 minus A. So, these four ratios along with the previous two. 
So these six ratios form, form trigonometric ratios of complementary angles. So these six are called the complementary angles, trigonometric ratios of complementary angles. Thank you.